Greetings, everybody. Welcome to day two of, um, what the heck? Sorry. Welcome to day two of um, the Ho'oponopono, or Ho'oponopono prayer mantra. I don't know if you guys were here last night at 11.11, but we're doing three days. And I'm not going to get into lengthy intros. Uh, welcome everybody i am going to appoint probably a moderator if you guys want to be able to um put in comments because i won't be able to be looking at the screen the entire time and so if i may appoint a moderator if there's anything inappropriate that comes you know somebody makes some kind of dumb comment you know something disrespectful um that is just muted or they're blocked because i'm just not tolerating that kind of behavior here if you know a person don't like what i do here they can go to another video that's how i feel about that <laughs> they, you know what i'm saying if they got a problem with me personally you know what i mean i'm just not this is a safe space for us you guys and um i just don't have the energy for that i want to stay on track this is not q a um so I just want us to be able to get right into it because most of us want to be able to manifest and a lot of people are asking what's hindering their manifestations and unforgiveness and bitterness is one of the main things um, even when it's valid and so Ho'oponopono is one of the highest frequency mantras designed and created by someone in Hawaii a long time ago um, that have proven to help us shift that energy, even sometimes when it's suppressed or in the subconscious. So we're gonna get into it in a few minutes here, but what I did for you guys today, I did pull from one of my conscious ascension decks to see, I pulled one card to see what area tonight that maybe you guys, what's an area that you need to forgive something, whether it's yourself, a situation, a connection, and the card that came out for many of you is clarity. So the, the thing I felt right away, as soon as this card flew out, is that many of you have stuck energy because there was some things that have happened that left you feeling a lack of clarity, which made you feel some kind of way, whether it made you feel hurt, angry, confused, and so this light language of conscious ascension activation is going to bring on a quantum level, okay, the clarity, the bird's eye view, the release that you need regarding whatever was unclear. Because sometimes, you guys, there are situations in our lives dealing with people, humans are complex, where we will never get the clarity that we deserve from them some of them are simply not capable it's so many reasons okay some of the folks passed away you know sometimes there's situations where somebody passed away and there's still something in the energy fields that has left us feeling like some kind of way so if you take a nice little gaze at this or screenshot it um you can go back and look at it later and this is gonna assist you with releasing it it may bring it up to surface but it's doing that just so you can look at it and feel what you need to feel and see it from that that view that they're going to provide set the intention to let it go and the story and you'll start feeling a lot lighter okay all right i'm going to start the clock the mantra goes <laughs> i'm sorry please forgive me thank you and i love you that is the entire prayer. So I'm going to be reciting it. And I'll be taking some breaths in between the Om mantras. And we're going to say it for 11 minutes. Okay. Now, if you don't want to say it, you can just simply set your intention to just relax and just listen to it. Okay. All right. I will upload this as I did the one from last night. I'm going to upload it to the YouTube for those of you who want to be able to go back and listen to it. Okay. Welcome, everybody. Thank you so much for joining. I appreciate you guys. I hope you guys are able to get something out of this healing mantra that we're about to do. And once I get that moderator going here, if anybody sees something inappropriate here, somebody saying something disrespectful to me 
or to any of you insulting in any kind of way just go on ahead and just take them on out okay we're not here to have debates we're not here to uh, challenge one's beliefs we're not here to do any of that okay so if any of you see something like that please just that i appoint you know what to do here um because yeah if they're not with what we do here they can go on to something that they are with right so um um thank you so much you guys all right <sighs> it's quite normal uh it's not a personal reading dear whoever that was that came in but for those of you who are familiar this it's normal to like start to have things come up so don't get afraid don't tighten up just allow yourself to feel your feelings it's just emotions okay that's all it's valid it's valid okay breathe through it know that that means it's being alchemized for you okay all right oh, let's do it I invite you to take several nice deep cleansing breaths just to get centered forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Oof. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. 
I am sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Wow. Thank you. And I love you. Whew. Images and messages are coming up. I don't really want to stop this mantra. But many of you need to hear it, so I'm going to go with it. I got to go with the flow. I got to go with the resonance. So it is good that we're doing this mantra. Many of you have had some experiences, some memories connected to religion. Connected to religion, whether it was through your family or through official religious leaders. And some things have left some marks because you were around people saying prayers, saying things like, you know, oh, let's pray in the name of Jesus. And, you know, they had all these conversations, but these very same people you were treated heinously by. These very same individuals, whether it was your own family or people in a religious sector, organized man-made religion. And that is something that's in the energy field because it created confusion, which is why the clarity part came out. Confusion because the very people that were appearing a certain way and having all these conversations with the well-to-dos or family members we're saying things in one breath the next breath they're talking about everybody around the corner like they're not a human being or they did you that way talk to you in a very demeaning disrespectful condescending way calling it love calling it authority. It was toxic. Yep, I felt something right there on the left side. It was distorted. It created a distortion in the divine feminine and what was healthy and right to receive, which created this energy field and belief system that toxicity was okay. And when we received that, that that was norm, but it left resentment because it was confusion. It's confusion. So take some deep breaths in. We have five more minutes here with the Intention Light team towards wherever that fits for us, for those that that story resonated with and why I received that message. Clarity, clearing that out on a quantum level, forgiveness of the self, forgiveness of the bloodline, forgiveness of the ancestry, forgiveness of the religious leaders, authority figures, even family members that's plugged into the organized religious belief system, the distorted versions of source, even Yeshua. May healing, may release take place for those who are open to it, ready for it. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. 
thank you and I love you I'm sorry please forgive me thank you and I love you I'm sorry please forgive me thank you and I love you I'm sorry Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. Oof, and I love you. Wow. Light team, thank you. Balance to the feminine. Balance to the yin. Bring in softness. Nurturing. True love true compassion, true leadership, healthy, balanced, loving, supportive. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. Wow. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you, and I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you, and I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you, and I love you. <sighs> I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I love you. Om Mani Padme Hum. Om Pari Om. Om Shanti. To the divine in you, I bow to the divine in me. Everything is energy. Balance is key. Live for yourself. Be good to yourself. Be true to yourself. Honor yourself at the end of the day. 
You are with yourself. Love and light. See you guys tomorrow. And namaste.